Good afternoon, students. This is teacher Roberto. And in this week, um, I'll be discussing or talking about or introducing environmental problems. Um, um, I'm going to be developing one objective, which is uh, to point out important causes of environmental problems and um, to provide some solutions to it. In our first activity of this week is um, you are going to research on the internet about one of these suggested topics. Water pollution, air pollution, cutting down the trees, chemical waste, nuclear waste, global warming, endangered animals, and acid rain. So you're going to be investigating about one of these topics. Once you pick your topic, one of these, I want you to make a one-page summary of this topic. One-page summary. And once you have that one-page summary, you are going to record an audio of of yourself of yourself about you know of of what you think of your impression about this topic, right? If you can also investigate about possible solutions to the to, to this topic or the topic that you pick, it's gonna be a plus. Uh, once you have you know your ideas clear on the topic that you picked, um, you have the summary and you know. Uh, uh, you know, you have you know some possible solutions about it. Record an audio of of the summary. Record an audio and send it or upload it on it model. That's gonna be for speaking purposes. I'm gonna be evaluating speaking, and I'm gonna be sending the rubric that I with the aspects that I'm gonna be evaluating in this one. This is the first one. This one is not for evaluation, reading comprehension. In all of my lessons, I have included reading because reading is important. We, we're going to be reading a lot of text in the future or also in the university level, so especially in English. So read this short text, read this short text and answer these essay questions, these four questions, answer them. Um, I'm going to be including these four questions in the quiz um, of this week. Uh, and once you uh, answer these questions, or once you, if you have any question about this, you'll also let me know. Our next activity is, um, is making sentences, right? It's making sentences. You, I'm giving you some prompts. I'm giving you this this box with um, prompts. You have to make a sentence out of them, right? For example, in the first one, uh, here you have to use should. You have to use must to give suggestions. Um, for example, in the first one, we have clean the rivers and the beaches. One suggestion that you can write is. Let me let me put this a bit bigger because it's not coming out big, you know. We should we should and then we use the verb clean the rivers. We should clean the rivers and the beaches. This is one suggestion. The next one is cut the trees. Another sentence is one suggestion, people must not cut the trees. People must not cut the trees. Sorry about that. The trees. So, must not is the negative of must. People must not cut the trees. I'm giving you the prompts. What you have to do is to make sentences with them. This is for writing. And the quiz is going to be similar to it. I haven't uploaded the quiz uh, of a week two because I'm still waiting for for some students that are not, you know, getting connected. So I'm I'm giving them time to complete, you know, the the 
the activities and the quizzes of first week then once I notice that most of the students have finished that I will be uploading the quizzes of week two basically this is this is it the lesson is pretty is pretty clear this one I'm going I'm not gonna be evaluating just uh, the things that I'm going to include in this in this uh, week are the writing practice which is the use of should and shouldn't please review this one review this part because this is the grammar the the last week in, in, in week two I cover have to and must and should but in affirmative sentences and this week I'll be you know you should be reviewing the negative part which is mustn't shouldn't and don't have to right then uh, yes and this one is also for the quiz so please review all of this and read this please and investigate about this topic basically um, what I'm uh, the, the the activities that I, that I'm gonna be evaluating this week are um, you know read your research about this topic the summary on the audio the speaking activity then the reading and then the writing so that's pretty much it students if you have questions about the the this lesson please let me know thank you so much and have a good rest of the day bye bye